When you think of breast cancer, you probably automatically think of women, but each year roughly 2,500 men are diagnosed with a deadly disease, and what's more, about 460 of those men do not survive. Yeah, our TV6's Elena Martella has the story of a man who battled and triumphed in his fight for his life. I'm a breast cancer survivor. Those words aren't something you'd expect to hear coming from a man. Men don't think a lot about it. Um, you know, I would have never thought about me having breast cancer and, until this happened. And I'm like, wow, this, you know, people need to know. But the reality is men are also affected by the number one cancer killer of women. We see male breast cancer about accounting for about 1% of all breast cancers, whereas female breast cancer is about 100 times more common. Daryl Skaggs was diagnosed with breast cancer in 2010 while being treated for a bad gallbladder. Not too many people would say that, thank God they got a bad gallbladder, but uh, the bad gallbladder saved my life. Now cancer-free, Skaggs spends his spare time supporting other men going through the deadly disease. I'm now involved with American Cancer Society Reach to Recovery, and if a man needs somebody to talk to, uh, American Cancer Society contacts me, then I contact them. And uses his test as his testimony. Beware, uh, if you have any kind of a symptom like women do, uh, you know, lump or, uh, you know, just anything, soreness or whatever, you should have it checked out cherishing each and every day spent with family and living life to the fullest. What are some of the things that you like to do for fun? Uh, mostly grandkids. Yeah. <laughs> we have four and they're just a treat. I get to pick them up after school uh, twice a week. Though enduring two surgeries and four bouts of chemo wasn't easy, Skaggs says he wouldn't change his path even if he had the choice. After it's all over with, it's actually been rewarding that, uh, you know, God put this on me and uh, now I've got to use it to, uh, you know, advise other men. From Brownsburg, Elena Martella, RTV6. Amazing to hear about his struggle there and the fact that he reaches out and says other men who need to talk, call him. That's great to hear. Yeah, I yeah. think there's that definitely big support group. Yeah. Well, Daryl says that he is a warrior in pink for Ford in partnership with Susan G. Komen. He says he got flown to Austin and New York to model a true warrior jacket. And every time someone purchases this jacket, a video of him comes up and he personally thanks the buyer. It's pretty cool. That